Hello everyone, it's Kelsey here. Welcome, welcome back to my channel, Budget Better Life, where I budget, cash stuff, and save for a less stressful, more enjoyable life. If that sounds great, you can relate. Thank you for watching. Alrighty everyone, so as you can see today, we are going to start some new savings challenges, kind of Easter-y themed. Now I'm not busting out and starting all of my spring challenges yet, but I had a couple of goodies in my last Happy Mail haul and I wanted to bring them into play. So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to set up my area and I will be right back and we will get started on some savings challenges. All right, so I zoomed us in a little bit closer and the first thing I need to grab is my bills binder because in the back here, I've got some money set aside for savings challenges and that is what we are going to be using today. So let's close this up and let's count up what we will be saving today. We've got 50, 70, 90, 110, 30, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 200, 10, 15, 25, 35, 45, 55, 65, 75, 85, 95, three, and that's five, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. So $314, I believe. Let's go ahead and set this money up. Alrighty, and there it is. So what are we getting into first? I think we need to go over here to this binder, which is my A6. And I've got some challenges in here that I definitely want to hit. So let's go ahead. Okay, so the first thing I'm actually going to do is start with this here. So this was gifted to me from a subscriber and she wanted me to show it off and play it. And when I brought in all of my Valentine's challenges, I forgot to print it off. So here it is. What I'm going to do is I'm going to grab a highlighter and I am going to try to find all of these Valentine's Day words. I'm gonna consider them a dollar a piece, just keep it low, and I'm just gonna go through whatever my eye spots I'm gonna go with. So yeah, I might speed this up, I might have to put a little music depending on how fast I find these things, but I'm looking here, mm, that's car, I found car. <laughs> okay, I found arrow right there arrow found i think i'm gonna use this one instead there we go it's a little bit better all right i found love i found crush is crush one stop chocolate heart smile oh yeah crush is one okay crush found crush i found card i found smile so there's smile. I found heart. So there's heart. I found Cupid. Cupid. I found candy. So there's candy. I think that's going to be it. Ooh, I found Teddy. Okay, that's going to be it. Teddy. Um, yeah, they're not coming to me as quickly anymore. So maybe... Yeah, I keep looking though. Okay, that's gonna be it, that's gonna be it. Okay, so I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So I got nine so far. Oh, maybe I should do one more and that way it'll be 10. Let's see if I can find one more. Pink, I found pink. There's pink. Okay, so with that, I have found 10. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10. Okay, so 10 there and I don't have an envelope for this, so I think I'm just going to combine it into this Valentine's Day one here. So hopefully I remember that I've put it into this Valentine's Day envelope, but I think I will. Okay, so 10 going in there for that one. And then we can go to the beginning here. And I think this one is right here. So let's go ahead and see how much we can put into this one today. This one comes from Lisa Grateful Me over at the Happy Mailbox Co. on Etsy. And I've got this marker here. So I'm going to do these two fives right here. And I think for today, I'm just going to do the 10. 
All right, so I'm gonna do 10 into this one today. And this one now has 20, 40, 55. Perfect. All right, so this next one here is my color roll and save. And it has two pieces, high and a low. It comes as a digital download on my Etsy shop. And I've got some high numbers here and I've got some rolls I could do. Why don't we go ahead and use my nifty new dice from Brooke over at Bee's Budgets. And yeah, give those a roll since they're one through, <laughs> one through three. So I got a one and a one for one, two. And then I'm gonna roll them one more time. So I got a two and a two, so four, five, six. So now if I take a one back and put a five, we're good. And then since there's two more rolls here, I'm just gonna go for it. All right, so I got a two and a one for three. So one, two, three, and there we have it. So I think it's funny I use like the super mini dice on the high board. <laughs> But hey, you know, you do what you do. You do what you want to do, basically. Five, six, seven, eight, nine dollars here. And then I'm going to do one more roll because that way I can get over 10. Okay, and I got a three. <laughs> How about instead of that three, we just color this three? I think that's what I'm going to do. And then <laughs> Finn's, Finn's having a blast. He's hollering in the background. He's hanging out with his cousins again. And so we're doing three more, which means five in, two back. So now we have five, six, uh, five, 10, 11, 12. So 12, I'm going to take the fives for a 10, and we're going to do 12 into this one today. And I'm not going to count this one up. I'm just going to drop it in and keep it rolling. All right, so this is the next one here, and I've got a couple of different challenges going in this one. And this one comes from Save with Judy. This one comes from Ellie on Earth. And these two come from Divine Savings Co. Now on this one, last time I missed a letter when I was counting. So I owe this one a dollar for that one. So let's just put that down right away. And then let's go over here and let's do the roll the dice. And I'm gonna use this die. So we're gonna do a three. He's hiding. You got a visitor. Do you wanna say hi? Hi. Okay. Do you want to put your hands in? Yeah. What do you see? He, um... A dice? Mommy needs to write down that three before she forgets. I see a candle. You see a candle? Oh, you're trying to blow out the candle? You're trying to blow out the candle. Okay. Are you having fun playing with your cousins? You want to roll the dice? Pick it up, roll it. Oh, good job! You I like want that. You want that? All right, I'll save a two. You rolled a two, I'll save a two right there. Okay, so that makes $5. Mommy's gotta save, boop. Okay, love you. Love you, bye, go have fun. So I told you it was a busy house today. <laughs> um, I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do, oh geez, I gotta, Oh, look at this one. Maybe I'll get somewhere on this one. I'm gonna do one, two, three, four. Let's do another five in here. And then let's do, let's just do two of these. So I'll go one, two, and I will do two of the hearts. So that will be four dollars more to add in here let's see if we got it okay so if i'm adding four more i'm actually going to put a five in and i'm going to take the dollar back so now i've got five ten fifteen going in to this one here let's for time's sake just drop it in and keep on moving here so let's pop these back in and that is awesome. Okay, so the next one here is the Skull Sisters. I love this one. This one comes from Mari over at Budgets and Chaos. And I'm gonna give it a scratch and see what I get. Ouch, Mari! That is steep. I was the one who made the, 
who made the amounts though. I told her one through 25. So I can't blame you. I can't blame you. Okay. So $20. Uh, well, I rolled a 19. So I'm going to put a 20 in and I'm going to take a dollar back. And that is it. I'm only scratching one. Okay. So let me drop my 20 in here. And that one is all set. Put my dollar back. I still want to keep this out because I want to remember to go back because I want to start those new challenges. But what I need is an envelope. So, okay, so I made my decision on what I'm going to do because I'm lacking an envelope. I am going to take this one out, okay, and we're going to complete it. So let's go ahead and scratch here. I've got a five. Dog's barking. Let's see what else I get. Ooh, seven, steep. Okay, so five, six, seven. What else? This one's a six. So let's go five, six. I got two more and it's completed. A four. All right, so a four means five in, one back. Okay, and the last one, nice and easy, breezy three. Okay, so I'm going to do five in, two back for my three, and we have a completed challenge. Yeah, yeah. and I'm going to clean up at the same time. <laughs> All right, perfect. Okay, so now we have a completed challenge. Let's count up how much we're putting in. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25. 5, 10, 15, 20. Let's do 20, 20. So I got my 25 here. I'm gonna take, and this one came from Ellie on Earth. It's super cute. I'm gonna take my challenge envelope, which is right here. And I'm gonna add my money together. So I'm gonna add in my 25. Let's get it all in order here. And I have 20, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 1, 2, 3, 4, 54. And the reason I have 54 is because I scratched a little extra on this one, or I started with two challenges. So that is correct. So I'm going to swap out the 50 for a 50. And I have my $54. And I'm going to take my $54 and my challenge. And I'm gonna grab this beautiful fully funded slip from Lady Die Saves and a paper clip. And I'm gonna take my fully funded challenge and stick it in the back of the binder here. And now I have a free envelope to be able to go back to some of these other challenges that I wanted to start. So let me just flip to the page. So this is the next one that I want to do. And it is so super cute. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to roll one. So I'm going to save a two there. So let's go ahead and put a two in there. And then I'm going to save a three here. So that gets me five dollars. And then I'm going to save a five up here and that gets me ten dollars and that just starts this one off so let's put the ten there that's where I'm gonna save it and then I am also going to put this one into this envelope as well and this one is super cute it came from Jennifer's debt journey and I am going to color off Four of these, I'll do a whole clover here. So two, and then four, and then this one makes six. Two, four, six, and this would make eight. And then since we're up to eight, we might as well do one more and make it 10. So we're gonna do $10 in for this one here as well. So I'm gonna set the challenge there for a second so it can dry. I'll put my 10 there. And then let's flip here. Now this next one is super cute. It came from Budget with Teachers. 
and I'm going to make each one of these bunnies worth a dollar. And let's go ahead and I'm going to pick purple because I think that's super cute. So let's go ahead and do a $5 bunny here. Oh, I could do yellow too. I could do like all different colors because they're like peeps, you know. So I'm doing a five. So there's my five. Let's do a yellow for two here. So let's do a yellow peep here for two. And then beside it, I'm going to do a green here. for four and then I'm gonna do another purple up here for five so that will be another five in so that will be ten into this one so let's go ahead and color that one and then did I already put the five no five okay I put that five two four five another five okay there we go so you take these two back and put a ten and I can take these two back and I can put a 20. <laughs> Hopefully I did that right. <laughs> you guys will let me know. You always do. Okay, so then, and I'm adding all this money together. Okay, so then this one here, which looks super fun. Let me make sure you guys can see it. Um, I'm going to take a six-sided die. I am going to roll. As far as I roll is how much I will save. So let's go ahead and do it. Okay, I got a two. It's <laughs> funny. I'm going to use my purple marker and I'm going to cross off one, two, and that is going to be $2 because that's two carrots. And I'm going to roll this one one more time. Okay, I got a six. So for a six, I have one, two, three, four, five, six. So I'm going to go all the way to here and I got $1 and then a chick is 10 so that's 11 12 13 14 plus 5 is 19 so i'm going to put a 20 in and take a dollar back and i get to cross off all of these how cute is this one this one comes from ali bear budgets on etsy and it is super fun and adorable okay so that one is all set now that concludes all of the ones that i wanted to start up today I'm going to close that up. I'm going to take all of these and I'm going to put it behind this challenge. All of those are going together into this envelope. Oh, should we see how much we save? Yes. 20, 40, 50, 1. 51 dollars. Awesome. All right, so let's go to this next one here, which is just a boba mystery. Now, this one comes from Snow Gardener 307. Super cute. Let's give it a scratch and see what we got. All right, so. All right, so we got a six. And, oops. And so that will be five, six. And I think we should go for another one here. I'm feeling risky and perfect so i went for one more and i got a seven so let's go ahead and clean this up all right so five six uh oh i need another dollar okay okay hold on this is what i'll do let's see how many dollars i have in here so far yeah so this is what i'm gonna do i'm gonna put a 10 in i'm gonna take three back so that's my seven that's my seven in if i can keep my piles straight here okay so 10 20 25 30 there we go I can swap this out or I'll swap this out for 20 10 15 20 let's do that just so we have some low numbers here so 20 30 is that what I had to begin with guys hopefully I didn't do that wrong you'll let me know <laughs> okay perfect and then we've got my Christmas book all right so let's go ahead and grab out my Christmas book so this is my Christmas savings book. It's called, It's Beginning to Sound a Lot Like Christmas Savings. You guys can find this book on my Etsy shop, which is linked in the description below. I'm on, I'm dreaming of a pink Christmas page and I am tempted to complete this page today. So let's do it. 
So I have a seven, so five, six, seven. Let's see what's over here. Okay, so I got an eight. So seven and eight is 15, so I'll take two back, put a 10, we've got 15 down. Let's go ahead and scratch this one. All right, this one is a six. So let's go five, six, and let's scratch this one over here. Ooh, and this one is a 10. So it's a 10, so I know I need to clean up. So let's do that first. Okay, so I know the whole entire book isn't completed, but it is a completed page. So I am blowing my air horn for a completed challenge because we completed this entire page. So I've got 10, 20, 25, $31 going in, and I want to swap this out for 20. So 10, 15, 20 for a 20, and I've got my 31 here going into my Christmas savings. Let's give this whole thing a count and see what we have now. If I can get things in order here. All right, I am not in order yet, but I'm close. I'm close. Here we go. Okay. I have 150, 70, 80, 90, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, 200. I should have, that's 201. I should have 200. So what I need to do is I need to make sure I only have 200. So one, two, three, four, five, six dollars. I'm just gonna put the extra dollar back. So I'm gonna take all six dollars here, put it here and grab a five. Because if I've done two pages, I should have 200, not 201. Yeah, so I just double checked that the pages were correct. They're each 100. So my math was wrong. At some point, I put an extra dollar in. But um, don't get confused because the book that I sell now, I've changed the design and not each page is worth 100. The entire book is worth 1,000. So that is, your pages won't be the same as mine. Unless you have the original book like I do. Okay, so 150, 70, 80, 90, 95, $200 is correct. And that's about as condensed as I could do. I could do another 10 here, keep some more fives and ones. Um, yeah, so there we go. That's what I have in my Christmas. It's beginning to sound a lot like Christmas savings challenge book. All right, so let's put this away. I'm gonna put the book up here and I'm gonna put this binder away and I'm gonna get out the next binder that I want to work on, which is this one right here. And if I don't get to an A5 binder today, I might not be able to bring in these new ones, but we will see if I can get there. But I wanna put a good amount of money into this binder. So let's go ahead and open this up. This first one here is a roll color and scratch from Brooke from B's Budgets. So let's see, how about we roll today? We got a two, I like it. I'm gonna grab a purple, oops, not that thick. I'm gonna grab a purple and I'm gonna write in a two right there. And I am going to put one, two into this one. So I think that's all I'm gonna do on that one for right now. I'll pop in the two, unless I go over to the back side, which is a low side, and I could do like another one. All right, no, I decided against it. I'm gonna leave it how it is, and I'm gonna focus on these other ones here. Sorry, Vanessa is talking in the background really loud, so unfortunately, I don't have much time these days to be able to film anymore. Um, $2. So I actually took on a full-time job. <laughs> so my filming time ends up being the weekends now, which means it's always going to be a busy household. I just rolled a two. I wrote a two and I'm putting two into this challenge because of that. Yeah, I have been, like I said, super busy and um, I have to film when I can. And so I don't always get the house to myself anymore to film. I'm going, I'm going for it here and I am just putting another dollar down. I'm doing a full row here. So I'm going to do another one, two, three into this one 
here. So let's count this up because I feel like I could condense some of these ones. Um, so I've got 5, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19. Oh, 19, guys. I'm going to do one more roll. I'm going to do it. All right, two, one, two. And now I can take all these ones. Isn't that amazing? So I'll leave a dollar down and I should have 10 here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Certainly, I've got ten. And there we go. Ten, fifteen, twenty, one dollars into this challenge here. And I love it. So these ones came from Ellie on Earth. I won this binder in a giveaway, and I have been loving it. All right, so let's take a peek at this one here. And let's just start coloring some cupcakes. Okay, so I colored three cupcakes for five, 10, 15. Five, 10, 15 dollars going into this one. And we have a whole row of cupcakes done, which is awesome. All right, so then I'm gonna do this one right here. And these ones are worth three dollars a piece. So let's go ahead and color in some heart shaped donuts right here. So I got three, I'm gonna do six. Heart-shaped donut is actually a difficult shape to color for me. I don't know why, but I struggle with this one. All right, nine, so I'm finishing this one up for nine. Maybe I can put 10 in and take a dollar back. Yeah, I can. So 10 in, dollar back for nine in, and then this one is completed. So I'm just gonna drop that in. And then let's go to the next one, which is Lovebirds. I think I'm gonna complete this one as well. So we got two, four, six to finish this. So we'll go five, six. And we're gonna do the little blue birdies. Blue birdies blue. We're gonna do these little pink birdies. couple little hearts here in red and that is it we've got another completed challenge here I put my six dollars down so with my six dollars in I'm not counting them up because I think it'll be a kind of a nice surprise so let's just drop it down and go to this one so these are two a piece and these are ten a piece let's see 10 20 30 40 50 60 how much money do you think we have left? 5, 10, 15, 25, 35, 45, 55, 60, 5, 10, 15, 20. Okay, I think I'm gonna do it, guys. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60. Did I say 60? 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60. Oh my gosh, I said 60. All right, I'm gonna go for it. I am going to color all of these. Okay, and that one is complete. So I'm gonna put my $60 down in to the envelope and drop this one down in. And we're getting closer to having this binder completed, which is really exciting. And then this one here, these potions are worth $2 a piece. And I have two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14, 16 left. So five, 10, 15, and 16. So we're gonna do the same thing. I am going to complete this challenge. All right, so that does it for that. Another completed challenge. I feel like I should be like dinging the heck out of this thing because we have just been completing a bunch of challenges in this binder. And yeah, that's awesome. So this one's complete, this one's complete, this one's complete. This one's complete, this one's not, and this one's not. So why don't I just do my last two rolls on this? I'm gonna do it with these die. Boom. All right, so I got a two and a one for three more dollars. So that completes that one. Might as well have a little cheer for it. 
and then put this one back down in now the only one we have left is the cupcakes for five dollars is that the one and and bees um so five six seven eight nine ten i can do ten there and that leaves me with a dollar so i'm gonna do two cupcakes for five six seven eight nine ten i'm going for it guys i'm just going for it all right so let's color my last two cupcakes okay and that is that so we've got that cupcake complete and let's look in the front and see if there's a one for Brooks. Ooh, there is a one. Guess what, guys? I'm gonna use up my very last dollar by coloring in this one dollar splatter, paint splatter spot on Brooks challenge here, this cute little panda. He is just super cute. So we'll color this in and we'll put the last dollar down. We didn't start all of the challenges that I wanted to, but we completed like a lot of challenges in that. So, so I just have to give myself one more because I feel like we did one, two, no, this one's not, but two, three, four, five, five challenges in this binder. This binder is Thick. I can't wait to see how much it saves me in total and yeah that was super fun so I really hope that you guys enjoyed this video I know I had a lot of fun please make sure to subscribe to my channel if you guys haven't already because I do a lot of fun savings challenge videos and cash stuffing you don't want to miss so that is going to be it for today's video and other than that I will see you guys in my next one bye <music>